Alrighty, folks. Let me just make sure you can hear the other one on the other end. There we go. You should be able to hear you now. Do the yes. Transition, but, um, yeah. That has been all for McRaethon 2021. We'd like to thank... First of all, I think we should get the obvious out of the way, which is we'd like to thank all of the runners that have participated in these last two days. Um, we'd also like to thank a few notable mentions as well. Uh, our volunteers that have helped us out this weekend, Kuno himself and Tiny Tim for doing a great job on the hosting and tech side of things. There's also a few other big announcements, I say big announcements, big thank yous that we want to mention, which is, first of all, BSG for allowing us to stream to their channel again and being very supportive of us um, and allowing us to use their server to stream to, so we're able to broadcast to here and to the McCraithon server. For them to help us out with the donation totals and to keep that up to date whenever you guys donated you know the donation side of things they helped with all of that um we'd also like to give a big mention as well to someone called shinyu now to put it bluntly shinyu provided us with the rtm piece that we have used this weekend now granted not everything has gone our way with it this weekend but um for the time that we've used it and for allowing us to use his server. We want to say thank you, Shin. Uh, we really appreciate you doing that and letting us use that. Um, and obviously, big thanks to Hypnotics, who's created the fancy graphics that you see, the videos, the intermissions, the introduction, the lot. He's done the absolute lot, the full package. Um, so from myself, and um, I think from Joseph as well, thank you very much to all of those that have helped us out. Uh, over this weekend you've all been absolutely amazing and really helps us out a bunch so thank you very much anyway with the thank yous done and dusted um we'll get on to the meat potatoes very quickly which is favorite runs favorite moments of the run i'll let joe kick it off but joe you got any favorite moments favorite moments mm, not really sure moments, favorite moments parts, but anything. but I think I was, when I mentioned at the beginning of the event that I was going to enjoy the NASCAR run, I think, yeah, it was uh, very entertaining. I really, really enjoyed that. It was a fantastic way to uh, end the marathon. I think over the course of the two days, it's hard for me to pick one. I will say the NASCAR run at the end there was very, very good. Um, but I think my probably favourite run that I've seen in like the last two days is probably going to be... Either the, and this is a bit biased, and I do apologise for anyone here, folks. Um, the CMR2 run that Zorf put on because he was able to show off some tricks that I myself wouldn't show off for a marathon. Um, but if I'm not being biased, and I have to exclude the CMR series as a whole from this weekend, uh, and have to pick something that isn't CMR related, uh, it'd either have to come down to NASCAR, uh, NASCAR Heat 4 by Kuno, which we just watched, the... Rouge Racer Type 4 run by Fantastic Fox yesterday, or... Actually, there's another two that I can list. Driver San Francisco by Jay Gorham. Uh, or I'll call him Jay just to keep things a bit easier. And also the Project Cars 2 run that we had by Boran Arrows this morning. Um, all very interesting runs, and also to see games like that be speedrun and things like that, I think that's something that we've managed to get around this time around. Um... Obviously, during the event, I think it's fair to say that they both doubt that like, one of the, the down moments was probably the RTMP server not working. Uh, that kind of goes without a question of a doubt. But again, we'll try and get something in place for the next time. But again, like we said before, big thanks to Shin for letting us use that. Um, aside from that, though, um, we raised in the end, if I get the actual donation itself, let me get the donation total on screen. We raised 110 euros. Now bear in mind, when we did the last run, the last marathon last year, uh, we managed to raise, I think it was about 65 euros. So to raise over 100 was very impressive. And to see all the different communities that have come together over this weekend, so the driver community, Ridge Racer, uh, Gran Turismo, Colin McRae community, Project Cars, NASCAR, you name it, there's probably been the one for every single person in here. Um, and, like I said, as a whole, you guys have really made the 
you know, the whole weekend an absolute pleasure to put on. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it uh, from start to finish. But that's the past and the, the present talking. But what does the future hold? What looking forward now? Now, a couple of quick things to mention. Obviously, we've mentioned a couple of times during this marathon, you may have heard that Macrathon is an annual event. That's going to be sticking moving forward. So, Macrathon 2022 is going to be happening. We haven't got dates for it yet. But what we will say is between either the, well, around the months of February to April. So, within those three months around about there, that's when the next event is going to be held. Obviously, in due course, over the next couple of months, there'll be uh, a rough date decided. Then we'll have a final date, and obviously some missions will be open. Probably towards either the latter end of this year, so November, December, or early next year uh, in January. But again, we'll have to see about that one uh, for the time being. But regardless of that, um, yeah, like I said, again, very final few words, which is, Thank you so much, everybody, for watching and for being a part of this weekend. Uh, we really couldn't have done it without you. And the same with our volunteers and hosts, um, and obviously Shin as well, and Hypnotic. So, to a lot of you, thank you very much for your support and for making this weekend run as smooth as it could do. Um, again, we will have some issues. We did have a few issues, but aside from that, everything went very swimmingly, and hopefully we put on a good show. Um, Joe, got any final words? No, all I have to say is I'm just very happy with how everything turned out and yeah, despite the ending, you know, it was entertaining enough and yeah, it was just a really, really good weekend overall. Yeah, so we're going to quickly just go to our final thing, which is that we do have a little thing on the left on the menu, um, which is that... Obviously, in the case of UKSG, ESA, BSG, whenever they finish, they usually raid somebody. Um, and from what I can tell, anyway, yep, from what I can tell, um, the actual uh, event will, I think we could probably go with somebody. Currently, I have a person in mind. And I don't know about you, Joe, have you got anybody in mind? Because I have. No, no idea. Um, right, so to keep on track with those that are still currently with us, uh, we're going to host somebody, so I say host, we're going to raid someone called Renaison. Uh, Renaison is currently doing a Need for Speed Carbon Career Any Percent run, so what better way to end the racing marathon than to host someone who's doing more racing? So if you like this kind of stuff, I'm pretty sure you will. Tell him Macrathon says hi. Um, if you wouldn't mind uh, from all of us here but thank you again so much for for watching and for being part of this weekend like so we really appreciate everybody um, and yeah I think that's kind of going to be it on our side so um, yeah hopefully we see a lot of people back for the next event so until the next one thank you very much for watching and from myself and from Joseph we'll see you for Macrathon 2022 Goodbye.